Apple fans, get ready to be amazed. According to the tech guru G-Man, Apple is about to unveil a brand new lineup of iPads and Macs. Mark your calendars for November 1st, because this is a date you won't want to miss. While specific details are still under wraps, we can expect some exciting upgrades and innovations. The new iPads are likely to feature improved processors, enhanced cameras, and possibly larger displays. As for the Macs, we might see a mix of refreshed models and potentially some groundbreaking new designs. Stay tuned for more updates as we get closer to the official launch date. Apple has a history of delivering cutting-edge technology, and the upcoming November 1st event promises to be no exception. The iPad Mini 7 is a minor upgrade over its predecessor, the iPad Mini 6. While the design is expected to remain largely unchanged, the device will likely receive a significant performance boost thanks to the inclusion of Apple's new A18 chipset. This will enable the iPad Mini 7 to handle demanding tasks with ease and deliver smoother overall performance. In addition to the performance upgrade, Apple is rumored to be doubling the base storage capacity of the iPad Mini 7. This will provide users with more space to store their apps, files, and media. Other notable improvements include a new landscape camera, which will offer improved photo and video quality in landscape orientation. The iPad Mini 7 is also expected to support the Apple Pencil Pro, providing users with a more precise and responsive drawing and writing experience. Finally, Apple is likely to introduce a fresh palette of colors for the iPad Mini 7, allowing users to choose a device that matches their style. Despite these enhancements, the iPad Mini 7 is expected to retain its current price point. This makes it a relatively affordable option for those seeking a compact and powerful tablet. The base iPad model, similar to its smaller sibling, the iPad Mini 7, is undergoing a significant upgrade. The most notable improvement is the incorporation of the A16 chipset. This powerful processor is a substantial leap forward compared to its predecessor, delivering a noticeable boost in performance across various tasks. This enhancement will make the base iPad more capable of handling demanding applications and multitasking seamlessly. However, despite this performance upgrade, there is a notable omission, Apple Pencil support. This feature remains absent from the entry-level iPad, likely to keep costs down and maintain its affordability. While this may be a disappointment for those seeking a more creative experience, it aligns with Apple's strategy of differentiating between its iPad models based on features and price points. Overall, the refreshed base iPad model offers a compelling value proposition with its improved performance and maintained affordability. However, the lack of Apple Pencil compatibility may be a limiting factor for some users. Apple is set to unveil a new lineup of MacBook Pro models in October, featuring the latest M4 chip technology. The 14-inch and 16-inch MacBook Pro will receive updates, powered by the M4 chip built on a cutting-edge 3 nanometer process. The base models will be equipped with the full-fat M4 chip, providing impressive performance for a wide range of tasks. For those seeking even more power, higher-end configurations will offer the M4 Pro or M4 Max chip, designed to handle demanding workloads with ease. Complementing the MacBook Pro updates, the Mac Mini will also be refreshed with an M4 chip and a redesigned chassis, offering a compact and powerful desktop computing solution. The upcoming Apple event in November is set to bring significant updates to the iPad and Mac lineup. However, Apple's 24-inch iMac and Mac Studio models will likely remain unchanged at this time. This means that users of these devices will have to wait for future updates. While there is no official announcement regarding when the 24-inch iMac and Mac Studio will receive their next iterations, it is anticipated that Apple will unveil them at a later event. Until then, users of these devices can continue to enjoy their current models. As we get closer to the November 1st launch event, more information about Apple's plans will be revealed. Stay tuned for further updates on the new products and any potential future announcements for the 24-inch iMac and Mac Studio.